GCC Maths is a subject where there are literally hundreds of resources, thousands of resources online. So making use and trying to find out the best resources can be difficult. I got a nine in GCC Maths and an A star in A level Maths. And today I'm gonna to be talking you guys through what I think are the best GCC Maths online resources and just resources in general. I'm gonna keep this video quite quick and just talk you through them. So please leave a like and please leave any questions in the comments. Number one then, you may guess what this is because I talk about it all the time. Corbett Maths five a day. Now these are not the five a day books. I'll talk about these in a bit, but Corbett Maths five a day is literally five maths questions every single day with the answers on the back. You can buy the books or get them free online if you prefer that. I bought the books just because I liked having it physically. Now, what I did with this is I literally just did it every single day. They've got different tiers based on the grades you're aiming for. And I started with higher tier. And when I got them right, I moved on to higher plus. I did this daily. What this meant was by the time the exams came around, I'd literally tried every single type of question in the core of maths in the last few months. It kept maths really fresh in my head. So Corbett Maths 5 a day is brilliant. That's what I credit my grade 9 to because I literally did it every day for months in a row. So make sure you're doing that. I think it's a great resource. They have released and sent me this. So thank you Corbett Maths for this. 100 days to go revision guys. I know there's less than 100 days to go now but you can catch up on them. So what this is, is basically like a daily sheet on a topic and you can scan and watch a video on it. So check out the Corbett Maths website. The resources are actually very cheap. I'd really recommend getting it and doing Corbett Maths. Next point then is MME predicted past papers. More on this will come, but basically every year they release a massive set of like nine GCC maths and science papers. I got these, I did them because you need loads and loads of paper practice. The predicted papers can be a little bit useful because they're topics that might come up, but I wouldn't rely on them too much. The point is MME maths sell a batch of papers that you won't have seen before. So that's a great chance to test yourself with some actual past papers closer to the exams and see how you're doing. Next resource then is Maths Genie. Maths Genie is great because there is has a massive list of all the topics and the grades they're aimed at. So take a look through these topics, find the topics you're good at, uh, find the topics you're bad at, sorry, and practice them. They have videos, they have all sorts of stuff, and these exam sheets as well. So um, uh, Maths Genie is really, really useful. Remember, I've done videos how to get a nine in maths. GCC Maths is all about finding your weak topics and getting good at them. Okay, so Maths Genie is brilliant for that. Next is on maths, which is where you can do a maths paper online. Now, one thing as well I definitely recommend is a whiteboard. Here's my whiteboard. 100% want a whiteboard. I'll put a link in the description, but what I would do is I'd get up on maths or some maths questions on my laptop and I'd just write them down on a whiteboard. I love a whiteboard for maths. So make sure you get that and check out on maths too, which is online maths past papers that you can go through and it kind of tells you the grade. Jesus E Maths Tutor is a brilliant YouTube channel. What I did was I searched up like grade nine walkthroughs because I was aiming for the top grade, watching grade nine walkthroughs, I found really useful. And then I'd pause the question when it came up on the screen, try and work it out. If I got it right, I'd skip to the end. And if I got it right, then I'd move on. If I got it wrong, I'd watch them walk through it. So make sure, especially if you're aiming for the hybrids, you're watching these really difficult questions being walked through. But the GCC Maths Tutor is brilliant. Final point then is exam websites. Just print out past papers. You wanna be doing a lot of past papers. All of these will be linked in the description. Please leave any questions. This is exam season now, so I'm trying to just release as much as I can. So the editing and the quality may not be as high, but I think what will benefit you guys the most is just the content and the advice I have to give you. So yeah, I hope that video is helpful. Please leave a like, please email or leave any questions in the comments. Thank you very much for watching.